Hey guys, what's up? It's Juan, and today we're going to be going over Action Launcher 3, a brand new app from the developer Chris Lacey, which is a launcher for Android that helps you customize your device in a lot of ways. So, Action Launcher 3 is actually a paid upgrade because it is a complete rewrite. So, if you guys remember Action Launcher 2 or Action Launcher Pro, it was a great launcher that a lot of people liked because it was simple, but it still let you customize your phone a lot. You could apply icon packs, and its uniqueness was that instead of an app drawer, it had the quick drawer, which is a sliding list of your apps, which was alphabetically ordered, and covers and shutters were among its much loved features. Now enter Action Launcher 3. Action Launcher 2, but infused with material design. Action Launcher 3 is a paid upgrade, but is a complete, a complete rewrite and redesign of Action Launcher 2. Like I said before, it is a paid upgrade of $5.99, so you might want to go ahead and check if you have any Google Play credit, but it's a, it is a paid upgrade, but it, it's definitely worth it in my opinion. I'll go ahead and tell you why. It's a complete rewrite and redesign, and if we go ahead and look on the flip side, you might think, oh, it's not worth it, it's just the same launcher. No, it's not, because it adds a lot more features which must have taken a lot of time to implement or add. So, I, in my opinion, Action Launcher 3's paid upgrade is definitely worth it. Going ahead and going into the settings which make this such a great upgrade, one of them is Quick Theme. Quick Theme takes all the main colors from your wallpaper and applies them to big parts of the launcher like the quick drawer, folder backgrounds, and shutter backgrounds. Like I said, I'll go ahead and open a cover here and you can see it's infused with the more prominent color of my wallpaper, same with the quick drawer. So I'm definitely enjoying Quick Theme and if you have top control, it also helps you apply that. Like a quick theme is also very customizable as it chooses all of the colors from your wallpaper, or at least most of them, unless you choose which one you want to apply to each um, element. So let's say if I want my folder background to be blue, I can set it as blue instead of the brown, but it usually does a good job with its default configurations. I mentioned before that top control is also affected. Top control is pretty much Action Launcher's top bar, which is pretty much the action bar, the Google search bar, Google search bar and a menu, and none. As you can see here, covers and shutters are still present, and, and covers are a folder, but it only, it's only an app icon. If you tap on it, it opens the app. If you swipe up on it, it opens the folder. Now, the quick drawer is also here, and it's just as smooth as ever, and it looks a lot better with the new quick theme option, in my opinion. So all of Action Launcher's 2's new trademark features, including icon pack support, by the way, are, in, are here. Go ahead and taking a look into the settings app. We can go ahead and go into the display portion of the settings and you can see you can choose your icon pack, your text labels, your shutter indicators, your cover indicators, hidden apps, um if you want a scrolling wallpaper. And if we go ahead and go into the layout section, we can go ahead and check top control, home screen grid, and um see if we want a dock and the scroll indicator. And for shortcuts we can open Google now, the notifications, settings, Toggle the quick drawer, lock the device, open all open shortcuts for the cover and shutter, and much more. Now these each have their own individual gestures, so you can go ahead and set it as you like. We also have some other stuff like frequently asked questions, help, you can rate it in the Play Store and see the version number, which is at 3.1.0 at the recording of this video. So all in all, I really enjoy Action Launcher 3. It's my new daily driver and it replaced Nova, which is very hard for other launchers to do. Guys, if you liked the video or found it helpful, please make sure to give it a like, and as always, make sure to comment any questions or feedback that you might have down below. If you want to see more epic content like this, please subscribe to the channel, and as always, thank you for watching, and have a great day.